Okay, so let's solve this problem. How long will it take for money to quadruple itself if invested at 20% compounded quarterly? Okay, so this is about compound interest formula. So recall natin. So recall. Um, call the formula. Yung formula is um, A is equal to P times quantity 1 plus R over N raised to NT. Where yung A, this is the future value. Then yung P is yung ating present value. Yung R is yung rate. N is the number of um, yung sa compounding periods, di ba? Then T is yung time. So, dito, since sabi dito, compounded quarterly, this is N is equal to 4. Yan yung N natin. Di ba? Pag monthly, so N is equal to 12. Kapag um, semi-annually, 2, quarterly, 4, then ayun, and so on. So, ano pang given natin? So, wala. So, let natin na yung P. So, ito, as in yung P. This is the initial value. Then, sabi mag-quadruple. So, magiging A is equal to 4P. Ayan siya. Okay? And then, anong R natin? Compounded quarterly, 20%. So, RRR is 20%. Or, in decimal, this is 0 0.2. So, plug in. Plug in lang natin dito sa equation. So, ang hinahanap is yung time. So, missing is T is equal to. Yan yung hinahanap natin. So, substitute the values. Magiging 4P is equal to P times quantity 1 plus 0 0.2 over 4 um, raised to N which is 4T. Yan. So, simplify. Maka-cancel natin itong P. So, magiging 4 is equal to quantity 1 plus 0 0.2 over 4 raised to 4T. Then, exponent to. Pwede natin kunin yung logarithm or LN bit side. So, magiging um, sige, substitute na lang natin muna to. So, magiging 4 is equal to um, quantity 1 plus 0.2 divided 4 is um, 0 0.05 0 0.05 raised to 40. Then, simplify 4 is equal to 1.05 raised to 40. Then, LN both sides. So, LN 4 is equal to yung exponent man di ba diba sa labas so ln of 1.05 then isolate na lang natin yung t so magiging divide each side by 4 ln 1.05 so ln 4 over 4 ln 1.05 equals t then solve natin yung value ng t calculator lang ln4 over 4 ln1.05 so the value is about um 7.103 or the answer is in one decimal you can say um the answer is 7.1 years so this is the correct answer okay